are closed. You can't come anymore. You gotta leave. Now. Leave now. Go. Get out of here. Why? Mr. Sir, Dr. Professor Patrick, do you like camping out in any Arizona national parks? Well, pretty soon all that could change. Meet Jake and Jonathan George, two brothers growing up without any national parks nearby. Ever since the state parks started closing, my little baby brother hasn't had any fresh air to breathe, and he just can't enjoy the beauty of Arizona's national state parks. Jonathan George, where are the state parks? Next, we meet Dr. Pond, an environmental specialist at the Grand Canyon, and, see, and let's see what he has to say about this. Hello, I'm Dr. Pond, an environmental specialist positioned in Grand Canyon State Park. How do you feel about the parks closing? I feel like it's going to threaten my job security as well as the happiness of many Americans. And why do you feel they're closing? Honestly, I can't say since they're producing well over 200 million a year and only costing 34 million to run. It's mostly just that private owners are wanting to charge us more to visit these national parks. The Grand Canyon, Arizona's most famous attraction, is being threatened by the mining companies who want to mine it for its natural resources, and only you can help save that. As you can see, there is no reason for these parks to be closing. And one of the most important reasons is these parks provide refuge for endangered species that might be shot down by hunters. And only you can save our state parks. Write a letter to the Arizona government stating your concerns. 